Welcome to Hereford Devlog 01, our first devlog of the series. As you can see, I've been modeling carts this week, so we've got some source images here. This is the first cart, and this is a Cromwellian coach cart from the Tudor period. And here is another Tudor cart <coughs> that I've modeled. This is the source image. Uh, next, with these are the finished carts in Mar in Marmoset Toolbag Four. As you can see, they are fully modelled and textured. So here's the three carts. <coughs> Just showing you these. And we're off into the game now. And here they are in game. Um, as you can see they look quite similar to what you see in Marmoset Toolbag but this is um, Unreal Engine 4 um, with uh, I think the lighting works quite well um, as you can see there's two horses in front of this one but they're not um, animated or um, working with the carts yet, yeah, that's for a future update. But the carts all have collisions and separate meshes for the wheels and they're going to be driven by physics. Uh, next we're off into 3DS Max, just showing you uh, what it takes to build one of these carts. They're quite simple really, just lots of extruded um, rectangles and cylinders as you can see it's all split up into lots of separate parts for, for for when it gets made into a physics asset we've got steering on the front which is which is parented to, two wheels are parented to the steering and the other two wheels are parented to the body of the cart <coughs> next we're off into um, substance painter this is your texturing program uh, as you can see here's one cart showcasing what the textures look like um, all finished on one of the first carts this is a very brown cart um, gone for the leather with the with the gold studs and slightly different color leather for the seats with um, couple of different woods and uh, metals. I'm just showing you how easy it is to change the color of all these textures so I'm just changing one parameter here and I can change the color of all the leather parts on the, on the cart. This is a Substance Painter 2017 I believe. <clears throat> so I'm just playing with some colors here just to, I could use, I could um, Create a couple of skins for the cut for each cart, so it gives it um, some variation in game. And that's it for the carts. I'm just going to show you what else I've done this week. Um, I've been building, rebuilding one of the main roads going out of the town. Um, the video might become a little bit jerky here because of um, OBS's capture of the game which I do apologize for um, but as you can see it's looking quite natural outside lots of uh, spline mesh roads and um, lots of painted foliage and we sunk the spline mesh into the road to give it that rutty feel um, and I'm using some Quixel Mega Scans assets for the stone walls and hedges I've created from Speed Tree. So that's it for the first road going out of town. That's Commercial Road in Hereford nowadays. And this is the second stretch I've been working on. Um, just trying to make it look um, rutted, worn and um, appealing wide enough for carts and horses and um, 
good to adventure on foot as well. Um, as you can see, there's large expanses of foliage, and um, these are all separated onto sub levels so they get streamed in when you get close. There's also a maximum view distance on the foliage themselves, so um, you can create lots and lots of foliage that way. Um, and that is it. Thank you very much.